shit. <laughs> I can't sleep tonight because I gotta write. Shit. I can't sleep tonight. Gotta fight these demons, clip their wings, for they take flight. <laughs> these are words from the heart for those self-proclaimed badasses who say shit like they want to tear that pussy apart. These are words from the heart for those who believe drinking and drug use is an art reserved for real men. You know, champions. I can't begin to express how infuriated I am. At least not yet. Here are sincere words for tough guys, full of pride and bottling their emotions only to die before that bitch he'll eventually call wife. A pussy's a pussy, he said, before she gave life to his firstborn. A pussy's a pussy until it's your little girl caught up in this world. Shit. I won't sleep tonight, because I gotta write these wrongs in my head before I wind up dead. Shit. I won't sleep tonight. Left my bed so I could write this instead. Go ahead. You said any hole will do, so correct and teach me a lesson will be unrecognizable in the end, and... Who am I but some guy with a pussy, but... I guess it applies. It's technically a girl. I heard someone say she. Well, actually, he is a man with some pussy perspective. Take it from me. Technically, true measure of a man has dick all to do with the junk he possesses. Don't believe me? Then please feel free to suck all three of my dicks because I'm losing track of this sick and twisted hypocrisy. Real men? drink regularly, and have man talk about their beloved bitches bitching about it. Real men at least act like homophobes. They don't hate on queers unless they're drunkenly beating or raping them and <laughs> double standards? Well, shit, there's no escaping them. If truth is a gem, I aim to be a diamond in this rough putting wisdom above tough, and if you don't think misogyny, ego, or greed is soiling this country, ask me why this was written at 2.30 a.m. in rehab by yours truly, that pissed off poet tranny. I'm hardly finished untying my straight jacket, but I'm dying to unbind this chest. See, I don't sleep on nights like these. Just rest my head, thinking about deadbeat dad, uh, Lady killer, a smooth talker, bar owners sipping on slings, hard lemonades, and Johnny Walker. I loved him dearly. And then his hands taught me how it felt to be touched inappropriately. You see, the court got distracted with those blurred lines of consent and forgot about my PTSD or admitted descent into depression. Assuming confessions will help us at all? I tried to be all of those boys, fucking selfish and making love selfishly, hid my truthful sensitivity with liquid courage on the daily. I thought I was bad. But then I just came to learn that walk and smooth talk of deadbeat dad, so... Here's a toast for the daily mass of coke, tokes, and jokes about drunks and inbred maritimers unstable and putting their shame under the table. Real men don't cry is a fable. Stop lying to yourselves. If you still believe being a dick will set you free, remember, life is short and hiding pain is costly. From yours truly, that pissed off poet trainee.